Hello guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. It's Ivan Srayola coming live and direct from the streets of Nairobi, Kenya. So guys, today I'm saddened by the news I had um, in West Africa about um, the border restrictions for Africans and um, it was so bad and I just wanted to talk about it. We as African creators, we should talk um, about such topics uh, for things to be better in the near future. So the other day, Wademaya was traveling from Ghana um, to Togo, uh, through Togo to Benin. And um, in the border at Togo, um, they should be passing through their visa free. What they should be doing is stamp their visas for free. But um, the officials there were demanding for payment, which is against um, the laws. Because um, people from West Africa with the ECOWAS um, visa should be passing through there for free but um you could see from the video that he posted the other day there were problems for him um at the border and some other blacks which is so bad the struggles of an african trying to explore their own continent breaks my heart things like this that happens at our borders always breaks my heart i've been deported in an african country i have been arrested in an african country I don't know when at all will an African love himself because if you treat me bad, you are treating your own self bad. Because um, I believe Africa is one, um, we are all black people, we should, we should all be unified like Europe. You, you, you can tell from Europe if you have a, is it a Scandinavian visa? When you have your Scandinavian visa, oh, it's, it's the Schengen. Eh? People um, walk um, in Europe for free. They move from one country to the other with their Schengen visa. Even a Kenyan who has a Schengen visa, when he, he or she goes to Europe, he can stay up to 90 days, which is three months, and move all over Europe for free from one country to the other. Like, there are no border restrictions once you have that visa. And it saddens me that um, an African who is moving um, in their continent is having problems um, with movement. It's something that um, the AU should consider, looking at it, the ECOWAS, the Eastern East African community, um, guys should come up with um, ways for Africans to move freely within Africa. It saddens me as a creator I'm uh, my dream is to tour the whole of Africa in the world and um, if I see such things, uh, I'm in shock. I do not know how, how that happens in this day and time. The Being delayed yeah, here at the border see, and they're having us come in there, I became a Ga Ghanaian citizen and I got my ECOWAS card. Now what are they doing? Right. See, they're not letting us across I, I don't the even border. know because even me, they no. are holding me. Shut I'm up. serious. They're holding How me. How is that possible? It's, it's, see, it's possible. They are holding mm. Watermaya. I love the fact that the diasporans are connecting back to the motherland, and it's time for the government of Africa to create a system that really supports the diasporans coming back home. Because whenever they come back home, they want to feel at home because they've been through a lot in the diaspora. You don't expect them to be going through racism in the diaspora, and when they come back to Africa, they go through discrimination. This is what we're trying to avoid if we are telling our brothers and sisters to come back home. The border restrictions were put by the Europeans who colonized us um, some years back. And now we are all free. I do not know an African country right now that is under um, uh, colonial power. All of us are free right now. The same, uh, the freedom we have right now, we should not have restrictions to fellow Africans. It's high time that we man up. It's high time that we move from those mental uh, torture that we had from the previous past and move on as Africans. We want one Africa, one people. Let's move freely within Africa. I'm so glad that the other day Kenya um, introduced um, visa-free travels to South Africa, which is something really nice. For if we are going to become manufacturing giants, we need to do away with these borders. We need to see the African market as one. We need to be able to develop giants like Airbus that makes components in the United Kingdom, that makes components in France and in other parts of Europe, but has become a global conglomerate. They didn't come together because they loved each other. We all know how they hate each other, we know. Yeah. But they've come together to survive. Africa must come together for us to survive. <laughs> 
survive and indeed prosper. For us as Africans, we Kenyans can go freely to South Africa, which is so nice. Let us have um, um, regional coordinations um, with each and every country in, in Africa. Um, the bond has started really well in Eastern Africa. I can tour Rwanda, Burundi, um, Uganda, Tanzania, Visa Free. The same should be all over Africa. I heard um, Kenyans can also go to Namibia, visa free, and um, if it's visa free, let it be visa free. We do not need to be disturbed at uh, the borders that we should be paying again. The, uh, corruption is high in Africa and it's high time that um, people just do their work and wait for their salaries at the end of the month. This is um, a message to the immigration officers in each and every country. Let um, transitions from one country to another be smooth. Let us not disturb people. Let us not um, torment people. Let us not disturb them. They've been traveling for long hours. Let them enjoy experiences in their new countries. We want to market these countries. I want to go to Namibia and show Kenyans what Namibia has to offer. We want to show the world what um, is outside there. So guys, um, this is a call for all the bodies um, that um, works on um, the border restrictions to come through and um, Africans to travel freely within Africa. So guys, let me know what you think. Let me know um, what you think um, that the African Union can come up with for Africans to travel freely within Africa. Thank you for watching this video and um, we hope um, that this may be an insightful video so that um, there may be change in the near future. Thank you so much for watching. Kindly do consider subscribing to my channel at Evans Raiola. I'm coming live and direct from Nairobi, Kenya. Thank you, guys.